I'm Dick Niffing. This is the Wednesday evening KRQE.com webcast. Mark starts with weather. Well, we do have a weak storm system coming in for tonight. That's going to help to give us the slight chance of a snow shower across the northern mountains during the overnight hours. Big story, though, will be gusty winds across the state for tomorrow. And then more snow sets in across southwestern Colorado and possibly northern New Mexico as we head into late Friday. And the possibility of an even stronger storm sits out ahead of us over the weekend. A Valencia County man who killed his three year old stepson got a break at sentencing today. In September 2009, Michael Perea came home after a night of drinking and became upset with Michael Montiel because the little boy had soiled his pants. He slammed the child's head into the floor so forcefully that it put an eight inch dent in the floor covering. The boy never recovered. Perea faced a maximum of 15 years at sentencing today. But after his family asked for leniency, citing Perea's tough childhood, Judge John Pope cut two years off of that. State forestry officials say a wind-driven grass fire that whipped through a stretch of private land west of Lovington Wednesday afternoon destroyed up to 11 buildings, including five houses. However, we're told no one was living in any of them. Crews were still on the scene late Wednesday, mopping up and keeping an eye on hot spots. No word yet on how that fire started. The fire danger is extremely high on the east side of the state, and strong winds are forecast later this week. Join us for all the latest news tonight on KRQE News 13 at 10 o'clock.